day six. Yes, day six. And welcome back to another epi. Today I woke up and I was like, I have nothing to do today because I wanted to go ice skating really bad, but the only ice skating rinks, outdoor and indoor, are either an hour or two hours away. So I'm pretty sad about that. That was like my plan for today. And then it kind of all fell through and then I was like, I don't even wanna to vlog today. And then I was like, no, I have to vlog today. And then I was like, well, what do I even vlog today? And then I was like, I have an idea. And Ronald doesn't know about it and... Yeah, what the hell is going on? <laughs> <laughs> we just have to go and leave him. He'll be really excited when I come back. So I shouldn't just watch your location because that's what I was gonna do. You're so psychotic. Could, no, because then I could figure out where you were, because I just want to know. Just start where I'm well, just, you'll know when I come back. I'm also running very low on caffeine, and we need to go to Starbucks. I saw someone comment about this. It's not wine, you guys. It's literally sparkling juice from Ikea. Let's go to the car. Um, I'm in the Starbucks drive-thru, but I was thinking, and I was like, I've had a really meh day so far. Everything just feels kind of like this. And I feel like that's pretty normal. I feel like you guys feel like that a lot too. And I just want to put out there, just to remind yourself every day that every day can be a new adventure. Go get yourself a coffee, get your energy up there, and go do something today. I hope everyone has an amazing day. I hope you guys make the best of every single day you have. I don't know, I was kind of in a creative rut and I was thinking and I was like, I have so many ideas, so many Vlogmas ideas. I just need to do them. I just actually need to do them. I was just feeling not it. But this is your reminder to do something awesome today. I mentioned in the beginning of the vlog how I was gonna do, do something secret, like you not tell Ronnie. I wanna go get the freaking nutcracker. He like did not let me get it because he thought it was pointless and a waste of money. But I saw your guys' comments on the video and I'm gonna go get it. I decided that every time I walk into my door, I wanna see that nutcracker. I want to see that cute little thing staring back at me. I'm also kind of really liking this whole vlog every day post the next day because then I literally get to see you guys' like responses and comments of like what I thought literally that yesterday, the next day. I just, I like how it feels like in Instagram, how you like say something and then people respond to it right away and then you can respond back to them or respond in the video like that I'm posting right now. And it just honestly is like so great. I love the immediate response. I kind of been vibing with this so far. I mean, today has been like not fun, but I'm trying to remind myself why I love it. Do you guys want to know a podcast I'm listening to right now? I have recently been starting to listen to Wake Up with Wesley. Um, she's like Indie Blues friend. She just posts, she posts interesting things on our podcast. I listen to a lot of podcasts. Actually, that's all I listen to now. I only listen to music in the car if I'm with Ronnie because he loves music, so I'll listen to it then, but otherwise I pretty much only listen to podcasts. I like it because you just learn new things all the time when you're listening to them, whether they're irrelevant or whether they're just like some little interesting fact or just like things to make you more woke. And I, I love that. All I want to do every day is just be more woke and just be more open-minded to everything and just get out of this little box that people try to put you in and tell you exactly what to do with your life. You have to do this to be successful. No, that, that's not true, like, at all. I don't know, this is what I think about life. People just think there's one way to live it and that's the only way to be successful and that's not true at all. But it's hard because if you go outside of that box and people will judge you and think you're doing things wrong, they think you're gonna be a failure because you didn't do what everyone else is doing. Just how life be though, you gotta do what you wanna do. Be yourself, boo. Hi, could I get a medium iced caramel macchiato? And then also a medium iced chai. Thank you. Have a wonderful day. You Good too. Day. Oh man, I forgot to tell him to mix it. If you guys have any recommendations of what drink I should get, please let me know. This is the only drink I ever get, iced caramel macchiato. That is it. I want to try some new things, but also I like am not a coffee expert by any means. So I don't know like what's, I don't know anything. So just let me know what it tastes like. Let me know how much you like it. Let's go to Michael's and get my nutcracker I've always wanted. Yes, they're still here. Wait, what? So many of them are sold out. You guys, they had like 10 of these last time, but like a different like selection of them. I'm kind of vibing with it though. Not me, just walking around with my nutcracker. 
You know, I actually kind of like this one because it matches the aesthetic of my house. Oh my god, this is awesome. I'm so excited. Let's check this bad boy out. That was the best purchase ever. That was awesome. Like everyone in line just had so much Christmas stuff in their baskets. Great vibes in Michaels. So I passed another store that was like a furniture store and I want to go see if they have Christmas stuff because as you guys know, my, my house is beautiful. It's great, but it could use a little bit more sprinkles of Christmas. Stop it, you guys. Stop it, what? They have so many more options. I'm really vibing with this. Why do I just love Christmas trees? And this one's like fluffy. Just saying, these little white pine cones would be so cute somewhere. So I found this vase and I put little pine cones in them and it's so cute. So I definitely need more pillows on my couch. I do think it would just like throw in the red a lot more, which we really need. Wow, didn't expect to go this hard today. <laughs> Man, I didn't get his immediate reaction. You're a loser. <laughs> I'm, I didn't even think of it, but now it makes sense. <laughs> Yeah, I actually was just going solely to get that and then I passed another store and I was like, oh my god, I have to go and then I accidentally bought a lot more Christmas decor. Why do you do things like that, Maya? I want you to go upstairs and then come back down when I made the final reveal. Honestly? Ronnie, don't do that! Okay, hey. now I'm gonna put it all together. Here are what the new additions look like. The pillows, you guys, 10 out of 10, makes the living room. Also added the tree and that tree, and then switched those around, put those there. I also did add this big boy. I hate how they're so long. I tried to cut it, but there's a fat piece of metal in between, so yeah, it's just gonna have to be long. So much better. Didn't expect to redecorate today, but that's what happened. Oh my god. I bought this baby foot exfoliation foot peel off Amazon. This is what it looks like if any of you guys are wondering. <laughs> I really wanted Ron to do this with me, but for some reason he really doesn't want to. I don't know why. This is an awesome time I'm having right now. It didn't say this in the instructions, but on the reviews, I read that if you soak your feet for like 20 minutes before, it gives you better results. Um, yeah, if you guys don't know what this is, it's literally just like a plastic thing you put on your foot for like an hour, and then you take it off, and in like 7 to 10 days, your foot will peel like tremendously. <gasps> uh, should I make a TikTok? I just made the funniest TikTok. It was like behind the scenes of your Instagram posts, and I feel like... I have like really funny behind the scenes. I'll do the max for a good Instagram picture. We need to wash the toes. Wash the toes. Oh, they're nice and pruny. Yeah, that feels so icky. That's awesome. All right, that's why I brought socks. So I can wear this over them. walk this feels so not right to walk in i'm gonna let these bad boys chill on me for an hour and then i'm gonna take them off but i'm gonna end the vlog here because they're not gonna look any different after i take them off we'll really see the results in five to seven days and i'll still be vlogging so i'll update you when that happens that'll be scary but i'm excited so i hope you enjoyed today's vlog and i'll see you guys tomorrow